Assalamualaikum to all my dear students. How are you all? So today we are going to start exercise 2B of book D1, and in this exercise we are going to deal with operational sign and positive and negative numbers and do calculation of the sign and write the answer, find the value. All right. So let's get started. In question number one, we are asked to find the value of each of the following. For in all these eight parts, the two types of numbers are written along with their negative and positive sign, and we need to calculate them and we need to write the answer, the write the value. So always remember in these type of question, we need to think about two things. The first that should the answer be positive or negative, and the other is should we find the sum or difference of the values of the two numbers all right so let's get started in the first question the positive 6 and negative 2 are given and along with it we have positive sign in between these two numbers so first of all before solving these question you need to keep in mind the sign rule sign rule says when we have two negative signs the answer of that sign will be positive minus minus plus same like when we have two positive sign the answer will be of positive so and the other sign rule says when we have opposite sign like minus plus will be minus and same like plus minus will be minus so opposite sign answer will be negative and same sign answer will be positive so let's move on and here we are going to solve this bracket Plus minus minus to six minus two, and then the final answer will be four. And always remember, we need to put the sign of bigger number. So the six is a positive number, so we will put the sign of positive. In B part, there is no bracket with the second number, so we just solve the numbers along with their sign. Minus plus will be minus. Opposite sign will be minus, and we are going to subtract it. So we will get. Three and the bigger number is eight, so the positive sign the answer will be three. In C part, first of all, we are going to open the bracket four plus minus minus ten, and the answer will be minus six. D part minus one plus minus minus seven minus minus will be added, and the answer will be minus eight. Now nine will be written as it is plus minus minus three. And plus minus minus answer will be positive six. Minus eleven will be written as it is plus minus minus five and minus minus plus two negative will be added. So the answer will be minus sixteen. In G part minus plus minus sign will be of minus and we are going to write eight. Same like one plus minus minus eight and answer will be. Minus seven. That's it. Now let's move to question number two. In question number two, we are asked to evaluate each of the following. So the same thing, we are going to open the bracket with the sign rule. So we have two sign in part A. One is outside the bracket, another is inside the bracket. So we are going to open the bracket with the sign rule. Negative, negative, minus, minus, plus. So in multiplication, we usually We just solve the sign and write the number. All right. In part B, again we are going to open the bracket. Five will remain same. Minus minus plus three, and the answer will be eight. Here we are not multiplying the sign. We are just solving the sign. Minus minus plus. So the sign of bigger number uh, will come, and we are going to add it. So answer will be minus eleven. Here minus eight, minus minus plus two. The answer will be minus plus minus sine minus six. Minus and one will remain same. Minus minus plus ten, and then we have nine. Plus sine because the bigger number is ten here, and plus minus minus, and the answer will be minus three. And uh, minus minus plus sine will be minus, and the answer will be eleven. And same like there will be two step over here minus minus plus seven and the final answer will be nine. All right. Now let's move to question number three. In question number three, uh, we are asked to find the value of each of the following, and the same rule will be followed. 
but the, in question number three, in each question we have three numbers along with their positive and negative signs. So let's see how to solve it. The same pattern will be followed, and we are going to open the bracket first uh, with the help of sign rule. Four will remain same plus minus minus seven minus minus plus three, and then in second step. We are going to solve it. Plus minus minus sign will be of minus three and plus three, and both will be cancelled. The final answer will be zero. In B part, so we can solve. First of all, we need to open the bracket. So minus three and minus five will remain same, and plus minus minus nine, and then these all are minus. So here we are adding all of them. Minus minus plus. So we have minus eight and minus nine, and here again we are going to add them both along with the and the minus sign attached. All right, so minus seventeen will be the answer. In C part, same one and minus eight will remain same, and minus minus plus. Here we are multiplying the two negative signs, so we will write plus eight. And then we are going to solve the number positive one, negative eight. So answer will be minus seven or negative eight, and plus eight will be written as it is. Now we have plus one, and you can also write only one. Both are correct. Now minus two will remain same. Plus minus minus one minus six, and here minus minus plus sign will be of minus three minus six, and here minus nine. In E part, in first step, eight will remain same, and then minus minus plus nine and plus one will remain same. Now here all are positive numbers, so we are going to add them all. So we will get positive eighteen. Now in F part, minus five will remain same, and plus minus minus three plus minus minus two. These all are negative numbers, so when we same sign, so we are going to add them up again. Minus minus plus eight minus eight and minus two and same like minus minus plus and minus ten or negative ten is our answer. In G part again we are going to write six as it is and plus minus minus five minus minus plus eight. So positive six and negative five will be one plus a and the final answer will be. Positive nine, and in H part, in fourth step, two will remain same. Minus minus plus seven and minus eight will remain same, and then we are going to add them up. Nine minus eight, answer will be one. Positive one. All right. So inshallah, we will meet in our next video. Till then, Allah is. Thank you for watching.